Hey everybody, Chris Collard here with you. I am up on the Rubicon Trail with Chris Silvera, and Chris is the chairman of the Cal Four Wheel Raffle Jeep. If you guys didn't notice, there's this really, really cool Gladiator. It's brand new, right? That's, well, 2021, 30 miles on it. How long have you been doing the Win a Jeep program? Cal Four Wheel's been doing Jeeps for over 50 years. Some of them started with CJs and locally right. built Jeeps and they've evolved to a master builder where a sponsor promotes the Jeep and does all the labor for us. So who is your, who's the master builder this year? This year's master builder is Verosa 4x4 Outfitters out of Diamond Springs. Yeah, Ben, right? Yep, Ben and his wife, Danielle. Yeah. Dan Danielle owned own the shop. All right. Uh, they've been in business since about 2003. So tell me about some of the products on it. Like, what are we looking at underneath? Like suspension and tires and wheels. And So this year we were able to get uh, Rock Jock to work with us. And so they gave us a three and a half inch pro edition suspension system. Rock Jock, I mean, that's Curry. That's Curry, Curry right? that's, that's correct. A subsidiary of Curry. Yep, that's their Curry suspension division versus their axle division. This kit doesn't have a set of shocks that comes with it, but Bilstein jumped on board to fill that hole, and we've got some 8100 series uh, reservoir shocks. So they're uh, tuned in pretty good for this truck, I think. So we get the, the Curry steering arms. Is that, uh, what else are you guys doing to the front end? Is it gonna stay Dana 44 or is it? So it's gonna stay Dana 44 that uh, the Gladiator has got 44s front and rear. Uh -huh. But uh, this year we're getting a set of Reed racing knuckles. So heavy nice. duty knuckles. And then uh, American Iron Off-Road donated a set of their ball joint delete kits, which is the okay. new thing now. Yeah. Sierra gear and axle also came through with new front and rear ring and pinion gears and bearings. See, we got some pretty cool dogs on the, down there. That's right, uh, BF Goodrich stepped up again and they gave us a set of 37 inch KM3s. They look good on this truck. They look proportional. That's right. right. So Raceline decided to give us another set of their heavy duty aluminum wheels, which we're very fortunate to have them working with us for the years. So we got some really cool armor here on the front. It's aluminum. Jen Wright, who's been a longtime supporter at Cal Four Wheel, Tony, we gave him a call and he sent us the complete aluminum armor package wow. that they offer for this Gladiator. So front, back, I see it's like underneath the wheel wells. Yep, uh, tube fenders all around, inner aluminum plates uh, for the fenders, front and rear aluminum bumpers and steel rock sliders because you know sometimes you still got to use steel the rock sliders that's they right need to be steel that's right <laughs> you guys know that right <laughs> <laughs> that is too cool and i see we got some recovery gear on the yeah warren is another longtime supporter of cal four wheel um, they gave us a ten thousand pound vr series winch with a synthetic line on it so you weren't going to need it though but we've got it <laughs> everybody needs a winch <laughs> that's true you know you may not always use it for yourself, but you always need a win. But I mentioned Bubba Rope. You said something about Bubba Rope earlier. Yep. Yeah, so Bubba Rope has jumped on board with us this year and they gave us a Jeep recovery kit uh, with a heavy duty uh, kinetic rope and some soft shackles and a bag to store all your gear in. <laughs> Excellent. Well, let's walk around the side here because I see some really cool stuff. This looks custom. That I've is custom. Seen this before. That is created from Ben Verosa. He's trying to build a modular support system for a rooftop tent. So if you don't want to run the tent the whole time, you can pull that rear support bar ah, off of there. And now you got a headache rack and a functional rack in the back of your truck. Yeah, you got a functional bed yep. in the back of your truck. Exactly. And then up top, we got a Cascadia Vehicle Tents St. Helen pop-up tent. Nice. So it's a two-person tent. It sets up in like a minute. It's no big deal. You pull the straps on the back, and it's got struts in there, and they just lifts it right up for you. Mm -hmm. Those things are super comfortable. Oh, yeah, yeah. Way better than the ground, for sure. <laughs> Absolutely. I think I've probably spent a year living in rooftop tents between different trips, different places. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm a, I'm a fan. Yeah, this is like the full package. And this is the rear bumper we were talking about. Yep. And if you notice on the front bumper and the back bumper, there's these extra wear plates on here. So if oh. you take some damage on there, you can replace those plates and the oh, bumper yeah. doesn't get disfigured. What other kinds of accessories are coming with the with this Jeep? Morflate is donating a complete tire system. So their air compressor system, their four tire inflator system, and a tire repair kit, because we've all had those kind of incidents on the trail. To top that off, Power Tank has given us another 10 pound portable air tank. So you've got all kinds of options for air. Um, how about comms? Oh man, yeah, I can't forget about that. Uh, Rugged Radios, again, they've been on board with us for a long time as well. And they're giving us another GMRS radio, a 45 watt oh, nice. uh, mobile unit with a bracket and a handheld radio so that you can give one for your spotter to use while you're outside the truck. We've also got 
a trip from Rubicon Trail Adventures donated to whoever wins this truck this year. Very appropriate since we're on the Rubicon Trail yeah. today. The Jeep is a grand prize. Is there like second, third place? If you don't win the Jeep, you're still entered in a drawing for a set of BF Goodrich tires up to a set of 37s of your choice. Or you can win a, your own Cascadia vehicle rooftop tent. Uh, they gave us two this year, one to put on the truck and one to give to somebody else. How does somebody, how does somebody win this? How can we put this in somebody's backyard? Well, it's $20 a ticket. Oh man. Hey. I got 20 bucks for it. You got a ticket? I don't have a ticket oh. on me right now. Uh, oh, come on. It's going to look really good in my driveway. <laughs> it would look good in most of our driveway. All right, all right. But yeah, all right. How do we get, how does somebody win? So you can go to any one of our events and we've got a booth set up and we're selling tickets right local. Or you can go onto our website cal4wheel.com forward slash win and you can order as many tickets as you want we'll mail them out to your house so when we get back chris is going to let me buy a ticket i guess he doesn't have tickets with him so thanks for joining us if you want to see this in your uh, in your driveway go to cal4wheel.com